The big day has come. The Jets have dropped their new uniforms. Let's take a look. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Jets HQ. I'm Howie. It's great to be with you today. It's the big day. The Jets have released their new uniforms. We finally got a chance to take a look at what all the hype has been about. It's been huge, actually. The, the Jets had a big party last night. They, they broadcasted online. It was fantastic. They had all the players styling, wearing, modeling the new uniforms. It was just incredible. I, I really wish that I could have been there. It was an amazing event. So got a chance to watch that whole thing. Got a chance to see the Jets this morning on Good Morning Football, which was awesome. Got to see them uh, bring some jerseys for the crew of Good Morning Football and style them and show them off. Everybody's really proud of them and uh, got some opinions. So I want to take a look at them. But first, I want to congratulate everyone out there, um, all of you have just graduated. All of your memorabilia, all of your Jets uniforms and jerseys, everything that you guys have, hats, uh, helmets, I'm wearing, I'm wearing one. Everybody now has vintage clothes. Congratulations, it's all vintage. This, vintage, all right? It just became vintage. Thank you, Jets, for making my clothes vintage. Uh, hat, got it right here. Got the old vintage style on it, the vintage color. Um, I can't wait to get some of the new stuff so we're gonna take a look at them but first gotta show you <laughs> my kids have vintage clothes too so it's pretty sweet uh, say goodbye to the old <laughs> my younger son likes Muhammad Wilkerson too bad I can't break it to him that he doesn't play for us anymore but uh, got the old vintage Wilkerson jersey there um, of course you got your old throwbacks of course you know you got the old the old Namath and that was vintage anyway you know uh, even my, what I was wearing in one of the other, another of the other videos, my old Revis, the Revis whites we got here, that's a vintage jersey now. Say goodbye to the, the old 24, it's now in the vintage clothes category there, so uh, thank you uh, Jets for giving us some vintage clothing. But anyway, it's time, it's time to take a look at and get some opinions on the new jerseys, the new, the new uniforms, so... Um, honestly, got a lot of good pictures to show you, got some video to show you uh, from the Jets' uh, party last night when they were breaking it out. So really, the first thing we got to talk about is the helmet. And I got to tell you, these helmets are sweet. Uh, I got what I wanted, which was what I, what I wanted was that chrome finish, that shiny two-tone kind of just beautiful um, styled finish. And... This is really beautiful. The, the color is gorgeous and it pops. And when the light's not shining on it right, it kind of turns black. So the Jets have the new black alternate jersey, so it kind of kind of cycles back and forth in the in the color in the in the light. Of course, when the bright lights are on the field, it's going to look this this beautiful metallic green. Um, but uh, you can tell, you know, just from the party last night and everything, how how it does two tone back and forth between green and black, which is fantastic. Um, now, so we'll start off, Sam Darnold was, was modeling the, the dark green uh, jerseys last night and man it is sharp. I love the green. It's not too far off from what I'm wearing now but it is changed. The, um, the green is, is just a really really nice Kelly green. It's what people were hoping for. Kind of went back to the, the 80's green and it's really nice. Now the Jets logo doesn't have the swoosh um, but they did kind of go back to those block letters, so it is nice, and it does have a curve around the football, so they, they did style it up differently, the, the logo is different, um, it's kind of changed, and I like it, I really do, I, I, I don't mind not having the swoosh, I think that the, uh, the letters stand out on that beautiful metallic green helmet, I think it's really, really nice. Now a couple of things, some people have not, have commented that they didn't like the, uh, the white or the or the green, depending on which jersey you're looking at, uh, the stripes that are on the on the shoulders. I think they're pretty sweet, um, you know. And I, I don't know. I, I kind of like the the sharp edge look to it. It kind of breaks up the shoulder and the and the sleeve. I, I think it looks pretty nice. Um, the whites. We had Robbie Anderson styling 
the uh, the whites. Now, I don't know if you want to call these home whites. I don't know if they're going to wear the green at home or the white at home. It's, it's, I can't wait to find out. But the whites are sharp. The lettering is nice. It's not that double block lettering, kind of like um, the Seattle Seahawks or the uh, Toronto Blue Jays. It's, it's, it's a solid block letters, but it does have the, uh, the, it's in green, and then it's got the knitting around it, which is black, but it's sharp. Um, I didn't really like the computer generated double lettering that they that people were saying it might have so I'm kind of glad we don't have that um, also one thing I was noticing in some of the comments and some of the some of the different uh, chat rooms and things like that people were saying that we stole these from Saskatchewan <laughs> the Saskatchewan Rough Riders or something in the Canadian Football League these do not look like the Saskatchewan teams uniforms I, I, as much as people want to say it does it doesn't the green's not the same the uniforms are not the same. I mean, I'm sorry that they have a green, green and white team too, but they're just not, I, I don't think it's anywhere close, to be honest with you. Ours are way, way better, um, way better looking of a professional team. Um, I like how they put the white jerseys with the, with the green pants. Um, I like how they put the uh, green uniform, the green shirt with the white pants. The white pants have the green stripe going down the leg. Very, very nice looking. It's a good contrast. I don't like the green green and green or white and white. I think that you have to have some of the color on one half or the other. And I think in this case, they did a good job. It looks really, really good. Um, and then, of course, the flip side, when you have the, the white shirt and you've got the green pants, um, I, really like, I really like the way it came out. I think that uh, Leonard Williams was wearing the green shirt and the, and the white pants last night, and he's just a monster, and he really really modeled these well. I like the way it came off. Uh, so everything's really good with the with the normal, you know, the home and the normal away uniforms looking really sharp. Now of course we've got the alternate jerseys, okay? Got the alternate uniforms and that is a black on black. Now I'm assuming they're gonna wear these on the Thursday night football or Monday night football or whatever just as an alternate day other than Sunday jersey and uniform. Um, really sharp. My, now, I, personally, I like the greens and the whites. My kids are loving the black. They both said the black is just awesome. Jamal Adams was wearing uh, the black with the 33. It was really, really sharp. Um, I don't know. I, I like all three versions. I think that they're great. Um, the, the helmets are just kick-ass. I just love them. Um, you guys, of course, I'd like to know what you think. I'm totally stoked for them, and I mean, it may, you know, of course, it's coming from love. I've been waiting for these for months to come out, and I'm just so excited that they're not terrible. <laughs> but, but I want to hear from you guys. You guys got to let me let me know what you think about the jerseys. Um, obviously, you're taking looks at at the pictures that are flashing up on the screen. You guys got to let me know what you think. Which is your favorite? Which which is not? Which is your least? Go ahead and rank them. Do you not like them? Tell me that too. I'd like to hear about it. Uh, I really think that these uniforms are great, and I'm, I'm, I'm totally in love with them. So I can't wait to hear what you guys have to say. You know, I can't wait to start doing some more. I've got next, the next one coming out with uh, the mock draft with trades. That's going to be really cool. You guys are going to be luck, looking forward to that one. That one's going to be great. I can't wait to, to uh, put that up for you. And uh, that's it for today. I'm really just excited. Congratulations to all of you guys out there with vintage clothing, and congratulations to the Jets on their new uniforms. Styling, they look great, I'm pleased. And uh, thank you guys for joining me. Can't wait to hear back from you guys. Remember, let's go Jets.